Let's check in now with Craig Bolano, the CEO and founder of Wealth Management Group. Hope you're doing well and off to a great new year. So what's your advice for investors in 2022? Now that we've turned the page into a new year, investors need to turn inwards and commit to several items. First on our list, do your homework. Investing is not speculating. Investing should only be implemented once the research process is complete. And far too many people are still using opinions as the foundation for their investment decisions. But let's remember together, it's facts, not opinions, that keep your investments pointed true north. Number two, patience. Don't let the profit killing emotions of fear and greed derail your results. You know, they say patience is a virtue. And when it comes to investing your monies for retirement in particular, patience is one of the most important ingredients. And be resolute. The sky will appear to fall from time to time as the crowds of investors get out of exactly that, the most crowded, most overpopulated trades. But when you're resolute, you're unswerving, you're gonna reap the benefits that rise when when the occasional bear market, recession, or asset bubble rears its ugly head. What else can you tell us about your predictions for the stock market this year? Well, Angela, there could be a lot more volatility coming back in 2022. Now, I didn't say a bear market. I just said a return to volatility. Really, in this case, more of a return to normal. Some bigger ups, some bigger downs, despite our view that the broader equity market should make forward progress. You know, as an example, if history is a guide, and to be quite frank, it's the only guide we have, the second year of a president's term, you know, there's a reason they nickname it the sophomore slump. There's usually some level of a slowdown in growth. And in addition to that, all investors need to be aware that the inflation has been more stubborn. It has been more persistent than many had anticipated, and that could lead to some rising interest rates. And if the interest rates do tend to trend higher, what we're gonna see is potentially what we call some multiple compression, especially in the most high-flying stocks that are out there, as investors recompute what's called their discounted cash flow models. So what's the bottom line with all of this? Expect more volatility this year. Lean into that volatility to rebalance your portfolios with purpose and stay focused on the end game, which is growing your bottom line by doing your homework, being patient, and most importantly, being resolute. I'm Craig Bolanos, the CEO and founder of Wealth Management Group. If you'd like some help with your portfolio and you wanna to work towards getting retired and staying retired, then check out our website, investwithwmg.com. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.